caught him. Players are in that box to try and get this one in. It's uh, in the midfield. Musa Buter again. It's a red job. I think as uh, Superpaka also make tactical changes in their lineup. Overlaps a lot. And I think that is a clear instruction that uh, that is the space they want Mayo for two Still Superpaka having a clear advantage here. Team, but uh, he had been suspended onto a very hard and harsh. I'm still waiting for the introduction of Kevin Omondi. Lama with Musa Mude. And a better, a better ball to Babu Kalia. It's Western's team up as a super parker. KPL top eight knockout semi-final. The second half of the second semi-final. Kogo picks it up for the super parker side. Today Kogo playing up. So. But again, the battle is for midfield, and it's getting a little... And uh, they've come back in the second half, and really reformed side. Patrick Agogo. Oh, from that side. Not a deliberate tackle there, but it seemed to have been caught on the shin. Uh, Max Rengo tries to make it work for them, but it's Musa Mude who ultimately comes out with it. He needs support. And then Musa Mude... Lays it up to Thomas Wanyama on the right flank. Three men waiting for it in the box. Wanyama, very young and very early. Pass heading to Tanzania and then to Europe. And coming back to the Kenya Premier League. Idris Raja picks it up and Musa Mude cuts right in front of his face. Well, the last step is on the side and it's uh, Musa Mude. John Baraza there, the scoring machine on this Sofapaka side. Going through uh, three Sony defenders, but uh, shot directly into onto the midfield. Musa Mude, a long lob onto the left. Idrissa Rajab finally coming into play as well. He's a natural left footer. He came up with <laughs> looked a little bit different. He's waiting for the referee's permission to get him back into the field of play. Musa Mude picks it up in the midfield and starts it with Abdullah Tifomar on this Sony side, and uh, Sony looking pretty good and uh, more organized if you ask me they've been able to connect the passes and uh, even gotten into the numbers up front as they try to lob it over to Ayo but that's the side that was totally outmatched Musa Mude hastening the speed finding space as well gets it to Idrissa Rajab on three yellow shots are waiting for it here is a chance for Kimani it's a lob oh it's Kimani salvaging it from going out of the field of play and gives it to Musa Mude Well, he's got space to turn in as well. Uh, and a good... Well, maybe you and I have got a chance to see it again. Musa Mude lobs it into the box. The header is there. And, uh, well, John Barraza is a judge to have had a high boot. But he really picked it comfortably, didn't he?
Tries a shot of his own. Good effort, but just over the bar. At a time when it looked like there were no options, Jacob. Well, I just decided to taste.